Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Brad over here at Chattanooga Fishing Fun. Here at Fishing Fun, we sell Ranger boats and Lance truck campers. So, apparently I messed up on my last video and didn't include a couple things uh, that were pointed out. Like, can you access these with the slides in and how do you make the bed? Well, let's find out. So, walking up to the 1062, first of all, you have your switch here on the side that's how you run the side slide in so what i'm going to do is i'm going to hold it down in and we'll just quickly find out here all right so that half slide is in all the way i'll show you there we go all the way in so with this single slide out in on this side you can still access the dinette, the bathroom, your kitchen, the bed area, and the fridge. All right, now we're going to test out this uh, side. All right, grab my trusty little remote here. We're going to run this one in. Somebody needs to play the Jeopardy theme song here. Run it all the way in. And always make sure that nothing's in the pathway of the slide out either so you don't crush it, run it over, anything like that. All right, we're all the way in. Moment of truth. Looky there. Comes in quite a bit. Well, see if I can shimmy on by. Okay, I'm in. But can I get to the bathroom? That's a big old fat negative. I don't think I'm getting through there. Nope. No on that. You can still get to the kitchen area. You can still get to your fridge. There we go. And still get to the bed. So if you're trying to be discreet, you know, camping without anybody knowing where you're at or if you're even in the thing, you can definitely still get in the camper, suck in the belly a little bit, but you're definitely gonna have to run it out if you want access to that bathroom. Oh, go ahead and run that back out. See how long it takes. We're almost there. And that took about, let's see. That took about 26 to 30 seconds. So if you don't have a spare 26, 30 seconds to run out of slide, I don't have a comeback for that. But anyways, it takes about 26 to 30 seconds and it is fully out. All right, now let's make this thing into a bed. All right, so when you're transforming this into a bed, first thing I like to do is just go ahead and get the cushions out of the way. Lift them up like that. Do that. Look up under here. You've got this little handle. Flop it on over to the side. And then press down on the table. I always just lock it back over into place. I mean, it's not going to rise back up, but there you go. Then I take these cushions right here. Go ahead and put them back into place. Just like that. Take these middle cushions and then you just shove them down in. I'm doing this one-handed too, so that's pretty impressive. Then there you have it. There is your Lance dinette bed. Give me one second, I'll show you what it looks like with a human laying on it. And getting tired, ready to lay down. I'm 6'1". I gotta lay sideways. There you 
you have it. That's what it looks like with a full grown human laying on it. Hopefully that clears things up. If you can access uh, the Lance 1062 with the slide outs in or not, it's kind of like a yes and no question. Yes, unless you're trying to get to the bathroom. If you want to get in there and you don't need to use the bathroom, you don't have to run the slides out. If you want to use the bathroom, run this side slide out, you're good to go. Like I said, I think I timed it, it was 26, 30 seconds, good to go. And then the little, you know, dinette bed demonstration, I wouldn't do that for just anybody, but um, I decided to do it for you guys. So um, thank you for watching once again. Hope you enjoyed the video, found it helpful and all. If you did, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button button lets youtube know that i might know what i'm talking about might be enjoyable to watch uh got any questions comment below looking for one or in the market for a truck camper give me a call 423-892-6272 uh what else we're over 24,000 subscribers now really appreciate that guys and girls um let's continue to grow if you haven't subscribed already go ahead and do so and hit that notification bell if you feel the need to stay updated with my latest and greatest videos it's a little windy out here so i don't even know if you can hear me but uh to the supers that keep on throwing money at me appreciate it it's going back into the business here uh just bought a new computer should you know have some better videos coming out possibly you know i'm not very good with editing but i think i can figure it out i um, also got a new camera so thanks to you guys uh able to get some more stuff to continue to try to make these videos better thank you for watching once again this is brad over here at chattanooga fishing fun phone number is 423-892-6272 until next time y'all take care stay safe and i'll catch you on the next one